If customer want to know stress by force, then we are doing simulation like this one. Uh, with moving of part and how I can say how much is for? For example, customer told us how much is stress by 200 newton. Yes? Then we are doing this simulation and how I can say how much for? Force is result of moving. So, to know force, I need to say solution right mouse button insert. Yeah, and here I can find probe, and here I can find force reaction. <coughs> probe force reaction will do it uh, for your practice problem. Force reaction, and this is the result. Force reaction of remote displacement tool. So it means how much force I need to create this displacement. So, and here I say force reaction by remote displacement 2, evaluate <coughs> results, and then I know how much force I need to do <coughs> to do this moving. So, yeah, look, it means my one second time was 70 newton. It means, for example, if customer told us, I want to know how much stress by 140 Newton, then I see here 70 and say, okay, the time is one second. Then I can see result by one second. So, maximum stress 230. Yes? If customer told us, for example, he wants to know force by Stress by 100 newtons. What I'm doing? What I can do? I'm searching here results for 50 newtons. Yes, and say 50 newtons is half of 100. And I can say, okay, result about 5. I can show this result, retire this result. Then I will see results for time 0.61. And now the last point, if I want really 50 Newton, yes, what I have to do? I have to save more results by simulation. So, and this is the last point for today, and then in two weeks we will do it again for our real simulation. So, how I can say I want to save more points by simulation? This is the last what we need to know. Here, out of time statement. It means program decided how much steps we are doing. But we can say, okay, manual. And I say initial sub steps. It means sub step from the beginning. One, it means one second. We are trying to calculate full moving, two millimeters. But we say, oh, we want to make 20. It's like 0 0.05 millimeters. And then minimum, we say, oh, we want to make minimum 0 0.05. And maximum, we can write everything. It's not important. If it doesn't work, then it doesn't work. So the problem can make less, 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 less steps. So if we do this one, then we have 20 steps, 100%. Yes? And then we will say results for every four. So and we see how our simulation looks now. You see, we can change. We can, we can make this step, yes? You see, we make 0 0.05 step, and problem saves the step. And now, look, if we have contact, and it will be difficult, but after contact, it will be again no problem. And it works so, uh, quickly, yes? Look, if you make small steps, more quickly as program control makes big steps and many red lines goes back and look, 50 iterations we finish. So, and then we have result for, for yes, for many, many parts. So, we can say, okay, with 20 Newton half force is so much stress. With 30 Newton so much, with 40 Newton so much. So.
We can always retry results. You can do animation if you want. Here, animation. And you can, you can see good movies. So again, we need to define material properties. Yes, nonlinear. We need to recalculate this animation part, second action part properties, relationships, non everything, no everything, and uh, contact. Then we are doing one simulation more, <laughs> but it's need maybe half hour or more. Or really? I show you only again that the small repeat again. Not equal to x zero. Like the more repeat, the better. This thing so you can do, uh, you can do also do this simulation. For example, yeah. I need one example more. You can try to do okay. it at home. I say geometry and then for example, I want to press what, and you can do 2D simulation also. And if you make a geometry of x is on plane, then you can do 2D simulation. Then you can save a lot of time. Yeah. If your geometry allow you to to solve 2D, for example, like this, it's allow me to calculate. Usage might be malicious. Then it's much more quickly. Yeah. So, and then you can do it. Uh, three parts, and I can uh, press, press, uh, two parts press. I don't think four loop. I press, and then ah, it's okay, it's okay, please. okay, and then it's on the geometry. Then I can say analyze type to D. I can define my contact between parts like fictional contact, and then same story. Yes, I need to say. No manual effects. Yes, next reflection. On RS6. No. Then I make my material properties, boundary conditions, and then I can do the simulation. So, what you need to know today? Yes. This problem looks like difficult, but in reality, it's really easy steps that we are doing always same steps. Every simulation has same steps. And you have a question by examination about it. What I need to do to get good results? So I need to do only four things. Yes, everything costs time, but if if I if I not sure, then it's better to activate everything. So then we'll get correct results. We need to define nonlinear material properties. Very important. Yes. So again. Uh, I did this Excel file, yes, it's recalculation. Everything what we in internet will find, yes, it will be difficult as what we need for simulation. So, for N, we need to recalculate. If N is want to know uh, yield stage, zero percent, and tangent model. So, we need to recalculate. So, but in reality, we have uh, our our geometry is changed, yes? If you have big deformations, big geometry changing, then it's uh, important to recalculate it again in 2SS, 2SS. So, as is calculate everything in 2SS, 2SS. Yes? So, if our, if our stress not so big, then we don't have big difference. So, you see, the zero state, same, same, same stress. So, they're more, Deformation, the bigger difference. So, but this is absolutely correct. So, but normally we are using also at work. Yeah, we are using at work always this one. But uh, for practical work, you can use only this recalculation. So, it's normal. But you have to think about it. Yes, in future that in reality our area is less, so it's smaller. Okay, this is first thing. We need to define material properties. And then we need to say a nonlinear effect yes, but now it's automatic always yes in answers. Then we need to say less detection on important and we need to say LSS no. If we do it, we will get correct results. So 
And next, uh, in the two weeks, we are doing one big simulation together. Uh, not big simulation, we are doing the uh, mesh. So, big question is, what is advantage of ANSYS? It will be also more inf big information, yes. Advantage of ANSYS is good meshing possibilities. So, for example, if I use SOLIDWORKS, I have nothing in SOLIDWORKS. I push button, mesh, okay, I make mesh fine, I have 10 million elements and I will never get results. So, in ANSYS we have possibilities to do many kinds of meshing, and we will learn it, what is a good mesh in two weeks. Uh, and that's uh, a very important question. We are doing it with real geometry for your practical work. You will get practical uh, uh, tasks for practical work. Yes? So, if you do your practical work, you will answer every question by examination, and you will understand how it works. So, until today, you know, advantage, disadvantage, family. Advantage, we calculate everything. Disadvantage, at the end, we need to calculate big system of linear equations. Every system of linear equations needs n to big multiplications, and it needs hours, days, weeks, calculation time. This is a big problem. And we need always to find compromise between, uh, we need to be quickly, yes? To be quickly, we need to read the knowledge, text with text. Should I and send then we can get our you want to read again? Speed. So, how fair do you know? And where do you need to find meshes? We learn in the places where we need solution, we need to find mesh. So, uh, what do we need for nonlinear simulations? Again, material properties, better in true as the state form. We need flash deflection on uh, nonlinear effects. Yes, everything. No, Should we add and some then we'll get correct. Should we add one so. photo? And all this knowledge we don't have to do the last time. We don't have to real simulation. Because he already saw so, And then we will so see how we can answer the questions. Is our part particularly stable or not? Okay, try to do it at home, maybe to learn a little bit, to do simulation. Try to understand it. It will be.